Hey guys, so before we start the video, I have put a freelance services link that I provide in the description of this video and you can basically go and check them out. So let's start. Hey guys, so today I'm going to share a really nice gig which you guys can start uh, immediately if you are an influencer. Now on Fiverr, many people don't know, but there are gigs where basically influencers put their you know social media reach accounts which uh, you can just hire and promote your products now my recommendation is if you want to start an influencer gig here uh, always uh, you have to just have some idea that uh, what are your target audience because in uh, all reality on fiverr you can get any kind of order and generic accounts are always good like generic accounts that means as you can see here these are mostly focused on you know beauty and all that so it's just uh, it's pretty much the kind of market that many people want to order to because there are many products related to these kinds of uh, you know your niches and stuff but if you are very targeted like for, for example if you are into some very like golf like if you are a golf influencer now there is not a whole lot of uh, people looking for that so if you want to increase the number of orders in any scenario number of orders and uh, but in any scenario whatever you uh, kind of niche you got you can always create a gig creating gig is free so always have a niche account if you have a niche account and if you want to go with a broad broad niche choose a niche which you know many people are looking for like for example let's say health and we are looking for health related products health beauty tech right and uh, many people are looking for what else do we got uh, i mean uh, there are there are different kinds of niches i cannot think of on spot but uh, we will discuss about influencers in our future videos how to basically hire influencers because many people and especially in the niche of print on demand in print on demand market you have to understand that in the influencer marketing can be very very powerful currently i'm testing a couple of influencers if the tests go according to you know profitable or according to plan whatever you want to call it i will share those influencer names if possible uh, i will ask them before sharing but uh, definitely i will share my whole campaign how it goes so yeah that's uh, that's and now there is one more niche where pets this is also a very good niche because i am already already working on this particular niche so i can tell you it's very profitable so that's all there it is for this one and uh, yeah you have to just and you, as you can see there is not a whole lot of com competition here only 1837 niche uh, gigs are available so you can definitely start your own gig here and uh, make sure that you have a good social media account always and there are two things two three things that you have to just keep in mind before you do that always engagement quality so engagement quality is very important most of the people who hire influencers check this engagement quality especially the people who are somewhat experienced in the industry so my recommendation is you follow these standards as they they look for number of followers post engagement and there are some websites which basically tell you the quality of uh, engagement and everything so i will show you this, those websites right now so number of follower post engagement and quality of engagement these are the three factors people look for before order getting any any kind of you know any kind of influencer so let's just go and let's see so here instagram account quality Instagram account quality. All right. So let's see. Yeah, here you go. Hype Auditor. Hype Auditor is basically a website which will tell you the quality of count. Let me just I have clicked on and it's loading. 
yeah this one right so the, this is basically a website which will tell you what are the if you're the instagram influencer you're looking for is good or not let me just uh, put any influencer's name let's put uh, i don't know let's put, let's just see what are what are the top influencers i don't use an instagram uh, in my free time i mean sometimes i use it but uh, i don't use instagram that much so i don't know a whole lot but uh, let's just uh, put uh, yeah all right let's just her she is the most subscribed most followed so okay so there are different kinds of accounts popping up so i'm pretty sure that's not the real one so let's just let's just see if the for uh, sub that means basically the accounts that are basically fan accounts let's see what what it gives to these accounts it is just interesting to see board check and it is no it's not this thing right now it's gonna load up 42 average as you can see average so here's something 0.99 i definitely do not recommend to go with a with, with account like this always have at least about two percent about two percent is necessary uh, and uh, at least that's what i believe and uh, for influencers my recommendation is do proper research i will show you guys how once my influencer test go complete i will show you a whole process of how i hired influencer what they charge and everything so that will be really helpful for people who want to get started in the influencer space or maybe they just want to promote hire influencers to promote their products so that's all there is to it for this one you can always start your influencer gig if you have a social media account with with good need a good reach and uh, if you already provide influencer service you can put a gig here too to get some more orders and uh, as you can see the pricing is forty dollar forty dollar thirty dollar twenty five dollars it always depends upon the account the account quality and you can use high pointer if you want to hire an influencer always check the quality of their account it will help you so that's all for this one so thanks for watching thank you